we find that the East Haven Police Department engages in discrimina discriminatory policing against Latinos, including targeting Latinos for discriminatory traffic enforcement, treating Latino drivers more harshly than non-Latinos after traffic stops, intentionally and woefully failing to design and implement internal systems of control that would identify, track, and prevent such misconduct. The pattern or practice of discriminatory policing that we observe is deeply rooted in the police department's culture and substance, substantially interferes with the ability of the department to deliver services to the entire East Haven community. We recognize the challenges and danger that police officers face day in and day out and respect the great work done by the vast majority of law enforcement officers. It is out of that respect and respect for the Constitution that we do this work. We based our findings on the following. A statistical analysis of the police department's traffic stop data from 2009 and 2010 demonstrate clear and significant disparities in the number of traffic stops of Latinos. We also observed that Latinos who were stopped were subjected to more punitive actions for minor traffic violations, such as being arrested or having their vehicles towed, as compared to non-Latinos. We found that nearly one in two, almost 50%, and one in three, over a third, of drivers stopped by certain East Haven police officers were Latino, when compared to even the most generous estimates of Latino drivers in East Haven, 15%. We found that the number of Latinos stopped by the department, by independent squads in this department, and by individual officers in this department, was extraordinarily 